Dunk, Duncan B. Landing. And this is Goose Bay just off of Rivers Inlet. The old cannery all the way down, owned by some firemen from Vancouver. And then Black Gold Lodge will be straight ahead here. It's owned by Jim Ruff. Great guy.
out. There's not much sense in climbing up. It's only 18 miles to the lodge, so uh, we're going to keep it right here at about a thousand. Transfer a little tip fuel to the front tank now. And then I'll go run on my center tank. And my tip fuel's gonna go fill up my front tank. Anyway, that's what we're doing. the water and our GPS says 82 knots that's a fair headwind it's not huge but it is a headwind and then off over here that's safety cove on Calvert Island and years ago back in the 60s and very early 70s that was homesteaded back in there. The government, Canadian government, allowed people. They gave them land, and they went in there and uh, basically lived and built roads with horses. Had a community in there, which is not happening any longer because this is a provincial marine park now. All of Calvert Island, all of uh, Hackai Pass, all of Hackett Island. Uh, 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 6A4 is just off of uh, Safety Cove, 1400 for Hackney. 
And you can see a bunch of little boats down here. Those are fishing boats, sport fishing from one lodge or another out here. That mountain is called Mount Buxton, B-U-X-T-O-N, on Calvert Island. There's some sport fishing boats right down there. And then across the way there's a couple buildings, they're red roofs and white siding, that's uh, Adam Broke Light, that's a Coast Guard station there. And you can actually look it up online and there's a webcam there, you can get live webcam there. You can see what the weather's doing. Just seven miles out of Hackeye Lodge. And Hackeye Lodge sits off of the west side of Hecate Island.
That's a beautiful Pacific out there. So it looks like we'll have a tailwind going home, which is good. Do a little overfly of the lodge here. So this is the Quak Shua Channel right here. Straight down the channel, you can see some yachts down there. That used to be Hackai Land and Sea. It's the Hackai or the Hackai Beach Resort. Now it's the Hackai Beach Institute. It used to be Hackai Beach Resort. Now it's a marine study place. People can go there and study marine sciences. Hackai Passage is straight ahead. The visibility is beautiful today. So Hackeye Lodge is basically just... Uh, Hackeye Traffic Chief, uh, Delta Delta Julius, which is supposed to come up, but uh, uh, landing Hackeye Beach. Oh, the goose is coming in. You can see a little pond up ahead here. That's a little bit of water right there. That little pond right ahead of us, that's the water supply for Hackai Lodge. And it looks like it's in pretty good shape. Then there's the Hackai Lodge right there. One of our planes is taxiing out. 6A4 is coming over the top of uh, Hackai Lodge for the... Oh, first minute. Uh, this, uh, this is the north end of the North Coast Atlantic State and Hackai Beach. 684 is on the left downwind. We're going to land north here at Hackai Lodge. We'll be on your way, no problem. Okay, we're looking for you. Just coming out in front of the Hackai Beach Institute here on the left base, left downwind turning base here. Oh yeah, we have the inside. Okay, got you too, thanks. Six eight four turn the final end for the north at Hackai Lodge. And just coming out of the little mouth here, Jimmy. Got you in sight. Vancouver 681 is going to be landing, or er, landing, taking off to the north here at Hackey Lodge. Three, four short final wind in north of Hackey. There we are, we're landed. There's uh, Jason taking off. And Chris did the uh, about a three mile final uh, westbound Hackai Beach.
paradise, folks. This is a great place to fish. Ready? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, we're ready. That's it, Hack Eye Lodge.